college students here in the Midlands, all the way from Utah to serve and help local communities. They're working with Sumter Habitat for Humanities College Challenge Program to build a house. That's what they're doing on their spring break. I <laughs> love that. Those are some good kids. News 19 Sam Perez explains how the community is coming together to support them. Right now, it's spring break at Southern Utah University, but some students have come here to Sumter where they're trading their swimsuit and sunglasses for a hammer and nails. That's probably the number one thing why I'm here. Serving others, which is why senior nutrition major Addie Mickelson traveled over 2,000 miles from Utah to spend her spring break building a house on Humanity Court for Sumter Habitat for Humanity. I love to serve and no matter where it's at, right? Because if when you help others, you really are learning for yourself how to be a better person and then you get to make new connections and everybody in the end is feels good. And so I really love the aspect of serving. Collegiate Challenge is the best time of year. Teresa White is the director of Sumter Habitat for Humanity, which builds affordable housing for low-income families. The yearly Collegiate Challenge invites students to the area to help with the effort. They are growing and doing good for others. And, you know, it, I don't have to be at the beach. I can be doing something good with my time. With help from community partners. When Sumter wants to, it comes together as a community and takes care of people. The students get meals from people like what the food truck owner Stephanie Miller and Donna Hebert with Sumter Board of Realtors. I think my favorite part is meeting the students and finding out a little bit about their history, where they came from, what their future holds for them, and how they are having habitat at their heart. Nate Brock is the assistant pastor at Jehovah Missionary Baptist Church. I have done overseas mission trips. Um, I've gone to Kenya, Uganda, the Dominican Republic, and I've also gone to South America. So I know what the hospitality of the people who are hosting you feels like. And, uh, and that, that's great. Over the next few weeks, Sumter will also get visitors from Boston College and Indiana University. For Street Squad Sumter, Sam Perez, News 19 WLTX. Well, the students also get to stay at local churches in the area for free while they're here. Great for them, and we are so happy to have them, and I hope Absolutely. the weather continues to hold out. For yeah.